Hello everyone, this is Cody Lee of BlackCatBooks.org, author of Eye of the Dragon, Cool and Beautiful, Rabbit Hole, King Dio, and the upcoming Lauren Frey. I've been playing a lot of Wii U games lately, uh, stuff like Zombie U, stuff like Kirby and the Rainbow Curse, and most recently, New Super Mario Bros. U, one of the most underappreciated launch titles I think of all time, because all I could remember when this game first came out in late 2012, like launch day Wii U, was that like, oh man, it's the same thing as uh, New Super Mario Bros. Wii, it's it's the same thing all over again, they're not doing anything new or in innovative with this one, and uh, first of all, New Super Mario Bros. Wii was one of the best games on Nintendo Wii, like a phenomenal multiplayer game, like I don't think I ever had more fun with the Wii than I did when uh, we when I got people over to, to play New Super Mario Bros. Wii, Wii with me. It was a phenomenal experience. Uh, but it was like very much a multiplayer game. It wasn't really all that much of a of a single player one. It wasn't like as well made as say like, you know, the it wasn't as fun to play single player as like the original New Super Mario Bros. was or like the original Super Mario Bros. games. Like I uh, I, I like Wii a lot, but it had a lot of uh, iffy aspects to it. I think you took what made Wii great and made it better, right? You had a same general format. You have like eight worlds, uh, some of the best level designs in the new Super Mario Bros. Uh, franchise. You have new power-ups power like the squirrel suit. And um, you have a really, really good 100% completion thing with like the star coins. That's always fun. You have like the DLC, New Super Luigi, which I don't think anyone's talking about anymore is probably one of the best things that Nintendo has done with 2D Mario over the past decade. Love New Super Mario Luigi U. And uh, the thing I noticed though, going back going back to um, going back to New Super Mario Bros though, is that like there is a very very well fleshed out challenge mode that I don't think anyone talks about. I actually spent like a couple of hours today just going through it, going through like uh, collecting coins, uh, going to, uh, trying to beat a course as quickly as possible, and uh, it kind of dawned on me that like as much as I've played this game over the years, <laughs> there are still a lot of things that I have not done in it. That's right, I still technically have not 100% completed New Super Mario Bros. U, even though I, I got all the store coins and beat all the levels in uh, the base game and the New Super Luigi U DLC. So that means, for those of you who, uh, who are paying attention, is that like, I have a lot. Of, I have. I have a lot of catching up to do. I got to go back and finish New Super Luigi, uh, New Super Mario Bros. U. Like that's right. I am playing my Wii U in 2022. A legit Wii U original release. I, I'm so excited about this. Love the Wii U, and I'm very excited to uh, to to keep playing it going forward.